What's going on guys? Today I'm going to be playing Stormworks once again and we're going to be testing out all three Domineers and both Tivs. And it's going to be very similar to a video I did a couple months ago where I tested all the Domineers and both Tivs in Stormworks versus a destructible building. Now in today's video it's going to be just ever so slightly different mainly being the Dominators have gone over many changes since then. Engines, headlights, a whole bunch of stuff. And now I won't be using GL Killen's TIF 2, I will be using my TIF 2. So now we'll be able to see which one of my creations will survive this massive destructible building. Um, so a lot has changed within that time. And things might be stronger they might be weaker but i've still tried to keep them at almost the same point but that doesn't mean it's gonna change tiv one back when i did that video didn't have its rust its black hood or or its new turret it had a it had the old stuff so with all that said let's get straight into the video all right now that we have our dominator one in place we're gonna just turn up the rain to 50 and I think I might have accidentally just spawned in a meteorite. Uh, boom, tornado. Okay, well, I'm not seeing any meteors, so that's good. Uh, deploy. Alright, and we're flush with the ground. Okay, so there are meteors. Of course, I had to click the button. Vehicle damage off. Okay. Whoops. Oh! They're hitting the building. Oh, never mind. They're coming for us. Let's make sure that our parking brake and starter is on. We don't want to... Don't want to run out of power. Okay, well with that slight little meteorite that hit us, I am now back in the Dominator 1. We are also sliding, the winds are over 200 so that is explanatory. We actually dropped down to the ground, oh yeah, okay. Okay, we're getting pelted with debris, vehicle damage on. Oh, 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 Dom one just got smacked. Hey look, you can see the fuel tanks and stuff underneath it. Oh, 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 ooh. Uh, this thing's definitely gonna get a fail. Um, this thing did not survive for very long. It looks to be undamaged, however. All right, that's 30 seconds. So I have definitely been tossed around, but I believe, all right, we're back down. Oh, we got hit with debris. Oh my goodness, we are getting smacked. Oh, just missed us. That Those are not gonna miss us, those are gonna hit us. At least one of them did. Oh. Oh! Well. I don't think Dominator 1 enjoyed that. Um, I can't even exit the vehicle. The whole vehicle is broken. Everything's broken. It broke so much that the uh, fuel tank hose popped off of the chassis. Thankfully that hatch can just be pushed open if necessary. Um, well, with all that said, uh, Dominator 1 gets a fail, so I guess let's move on to Dominator 2. All right, now we have Dominator 2 here. This is the 2013 model. By the way, if you guys are not currently aware, as I haven't posted a video about them, and I'm probably not going to, but 
this is going to be it, I guess. So, if you guys haven't noticed already, if you guys go to the Dominator 1, 2, th and 3 on the Steam Workshop, you'll see they have different variants, different years. There's Dominator 3, 2013 and 2024. Dominator 2 has 2020... Um, or not 2020. It has uh, 2012, 13, and 14. And then Dom 1 has 2024, uh, 2013, 2012, and I'm not sure. I already forgot all the rest, but I've made variants for each vehicle, so if you guys want to go check them out, please go check them out on the Steam Workshop. Just go to the normal Dominator 1, 2, and 3's page, and I'll have their linked on the side, and you can go and download them if you guys want different models. In this one's case, this is the 2013 Dominator 2, which is definitely probably my favorite. Um, so we're going to just jump up in here and see if we can survive a tornado. Yeah, once we hit like 180, 190, we're kind of screwed. Uh, there it is, 180. We're, we're done. We are airborne. Um, we... Ow! We are being hit with debris right now. Uh, things are not looking good. We caught big time air. Ooh, there it is again. We're gonna anchor. Not seemingly. Nope. Oh boy. I believe the airbags are broken. Oh. Starter's not even on. Okay, so the airbags are not broken. And it should still move. Um, yeah. So looks like we just got a bunch of back end damage. Alright, so with all that. Okay. Anyway, with all that said, so it looks like we have another failure. Um, Dominator 2 did not survive. How, um. Way less damage than Dom 1, though, and I survived. So, yeah, Dom 2 did pretty good. So I guess let's move on to Dominator 3. All right, now we have the Dominator 3 here, and we're going to see if it'll survive a tornado. Um, let's jump up in here, hit the starter, close the door, low beams, why not? The building's falling apart again already. Let's go rain. Spawn our tornado. Drop airbags. We dropped all the way. Indeed. Alright. Moment of truth. Will Dominator 3 survive? Um. Hopefully. Um. It should. Um. We are currently, there's currently a floating window just going up to heaven. Oh shoot, I forgot, I have to engage the starter in order to see my thing now. Uh, 150. Oh, 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 we're getting hit with debris. Oh, 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 this is not good. Oh, oh. All right, and the timer has started for 30 seconds. Oh, ooh, got hit. Oh, ah. oh, we're getting hit big time. Oh, Dom3 is not enjoying this. Come on, Dom3, you just have to survive 15 more seconds. It's not going to. That was way too much debris for it to handle. Okay, that's time. Okay, well, that was time. Oh. Something. Oh. Oh. Oh, we just got badly damaged. Wow. Are we gonna roll over? Oh, there's debris. Oh, our mirror's stuck in the ground. Did not 
expect that. All right, well, now with those results, um, I think it's very safe to say um, Dominator 3 will survive unless you have, like, probably 20 pieces of debris smacking the front end of your vehicle. So Dominator 3 also gets a fail, which is also surprising to me. Um, so that is definitely interesting. I was not expecting that from Dom 3. Um, but it did, I guess, take on a bunch of debris, so... Um, it... It did good. It did better than uh, Dom 1. Dom 2 did better than this, though. Dom 2 might not have lasted longer on the ground, but it definitely sustained less damage once it was in the air. So, Dominator 3, 2, and 1 both get a fail because probably how close they're put to the building. Anyway, let's go ahead and move on to TIV 1. Alright, now that we have the TIV 1 spawned in, we're going to spawn in our tornado. And we're going to run into the TIV 1. I'm gonna flip the deployment button. All right, Tiv One's currently deploying. I'm gonna go if I can, if it'll ever let me. Shut up, phone. Okay, we are slowly but surely deploying. Okay, we anchored just in time because the rear spike started coming up. Let's go ahead and put on the rain. Starter on? No, of course it's not. Oh, that's some debris. Oh boy. Oh, oh, there's tornado. Oh, it's gonna have Dominator 3's problem. Oh, crap. Why are we still here? Just to suffer? Yep, where it would have been fine if it didn't get hit with a massive ball of debris. Dang. Um. Yep, it had Dominator 3's problem. I think they're too close to the building, but. Hey, this is for, this is for science. Um. Clearly, at close range, none of the vehicles so far have survived. So I think what's happening is they're too close to the buildings, so they just, the debris goes one way and it comes back as this big, big ball of debris and it just smacks them and they can't handle it, so. Um, another fail. Um, will Tiv 2 prevail? Um, its older brother clearly did not. Um, this is the worst one of the entire video, so. Anyways, with all that said, I'm fearful for my life. Um, okay, I was going to say, I'm pretty sure the side panels are going down, but I can't quite tell, so. Where's our, there they are, I was going to say, where's our rears? Where's the front panel? Come on, get it down. Oh my gosh, it's so slow. Crank up the rain. Come on, side spikes, get in there. Okay. Oh, that building's coming apart. Quick. Okay, we are now fully deployed. Um, we're getting hit with debris already. Where's the tornado? It's gonna form like right in front of us, I bet. Yeah. All right. Will the tip two survive for 30 seconds? The big ball of debris is right over there. Oh my goodness, we just missed the ball of debris. At least the big one. Tip 2 is still just getting absolutely pelted. We, we're done, we're cooked. Um, wow, that is actually impressive to me. Tiv 2, Tiv 2. The strongest intercept vehicle did not hold on for very long. Good lord. Wow. And see, I don't think it's the tornadoes that can't survive. We are on fire. This is not good. Uh, bail before the thing breaks. <gasps> oh no, run before it squishes me. 
I, yeah, I don't I don't think it's the tornadoes that they can't withstand. It's the debris, those massive clumps of debris that just smack it. So, yeah, they definitely do not enjoy it. That's for sure. Um, the Tiv one or Tiv two, my bad. Tiv two is currently hugging some debris. So, wow. Oh my goody goodness. The Tiv the Tivs did the worst, which is not good for Tiv one. Dom two did the best. Dom two did the best, which is very surprising. Um Yeah, I was not expecting that. Alright, so now we have this massive lineup of Dominators, Tivs, um, etc. So we should um we should get to see how all of them behave. So um just a normal tornado, no building. Um uh, this is just to see if they will survive without debris. Um and we're gonna do them all at the same time because why not? So we have two thousand um I don't that's just the base Dom three or one man. That's the base Dom one. That is 2013 Dominator 1, 2014, 2024, and then here we have 2012 Dom 2, 2013 Dom 2, and 2014 Dom 2. Here we have 2024 Dom 3 and 2013 Dom 3, the Tiv 2 and Tiv 1. So with all that being said, I don't know which vehicle is going to survive, so hopefully all of them, but I don't know which one will. So as you can see, there are some differences between each model because they're different models. But um, some Dom ones have roof bubbles, others do not, others are colored different. They all like have, dang it. They all have like the same structural integrity of each other. So like one's not weaker than the other. They're all the same basically. Now the Dom 2s, their structural integrity is actually worse from model to model. So tw 2012, um, it is it has a worse threshold than 2013, and 2014 has a worse threshold than 2012. So, and if you're wondering why these three vehicles are worse and some are better, it's because the 2014 one has no front like um, bumper and no rear bumper, uh, like no guard to keep the wind out from underneath the vehicle. 2013 does, and 2012 does on the front, but doesn't in the rear. So there is a slight difference between them. Okay, so I want to spawn the tornado in the middle, which is probably the 2013 Dom 2. And let's go. Alright. Every vehicle, every single vehicle is deployed. So. Moment of truth, which one will survive? So. Looks like that the Dominator ones are gonna go first. Of course, they're gonna. 170. It's almost over Dom 2's. All the Dom 2's thresholds. 200, and there goes all the doms except for 2013 2013 still sitting and strong 2013 really oh never mind it's gone it's because it's 220 dom is dom three sideways or a little sideways just a little bit but no point proven if there's no debris Obviously, there's no debris. You'll be definitely more okay. But I don't think it's just the no debris. They can handle debris. They just can't handle massive clumps of debris just being piled onto you. Then you're screwed. So. Oh my goodness. The Dom 1s are just sliding around across the floor. And the Dom 2s are slamming into Dom 3s. Oh no. I've created more debris by adding more vehicles. What the heck happened to Tiv 2? Oh. Alright. Yeah, what the heck happened to Tiv 2? And what is happening to the Dominator 3s? Oh, I'm cooked. 
The Dom 3s are currently sideways. I don't know if this engine has something to do with that. I'm not sure. Don't think so. Because they were fine earlier. Alright. I think that's probably good enough. It's been over a minute. Over two minutes now. Yeah, what the heck happened to Tiv 2? What on earth? It's like sideways. Its side panel is like bent. And yeah, the hood sustained some damage. We're like, what the heck happened? Uh oh. Oh no! Oh, good heavens. Uh, 2024 Dom 3 is in the air. Oh boy. 2013 Dom 3 is also in the air. Tiv 2 just got smacked. I think Tiv 1's surviving the most. Okay, 2014 Dom 3 just landed. Oh my gosh, look at that Dom 2. Is that 2012? I can't tell if it's 2012 or not. It's definitely... Oh, I think that's... Oh, that's... Yeah, no, that's 2013. Oh my gosh. Holy smokes. Okay. So, Dom 3, 2024 Dom 3. It's got some sh some body damage. It looks like what it looked like when I ever hit the deer, if I'm being honest. Um, anyway, so we have a little bit of, like, damage in the back of the vehicle. <laughs> I think the doors still work. Yep. So Dom, as you can tell, they can survive a tornado. It's the debris. And even with all the debris, that being the other like 9,000 pound vehicles, they still held up pretty good. This one didn't even get hit. And Tip 2, man. Tip 2 got absolutely bashed. Look at <laughs> Tip 2, my goodness. Oh my word, Dom. Okay, so 20, this is 2012 Dom 2, so. 2014 Dom 1 is absolutely lit aflame. 2013 Dom 1's on fire too. Um, the base Dom 1's damaged but not on fire. 2013 Dom 2 is absolutely on fire. Okay, I was going to say, is there no damage to 2013 Dom 2 I, or 2014? I will be super surprised. The one vehicle that survived, with no, the other vehicle that did not, or that survived with TIV 1, is the 2013 Dominator 3. Wow. That is actually quite impressive, all these vehicles. All right, so now I think we know what would happen if any vehicle or if the Dominators and Tivs were up against a building. They will do fine with some debris, just not massive orbs worth of it. And then they will do fine with a normal tornado without multiple, like, 10,000 plus pound vehicles hurling towards you. So with all that said, I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day. And of course, subscribe. Let me know down in the comments what you guys want to see next. This video was really fun actually so i'm really happy i made it um and by the way this video by the time it was posted is the time it was recorded so this video is fresh how you say hope you all have a wonderful first of your day and of course subscribe